do a short demonstration of the new Fiat 900 and uh, show how easy it is to use and how simple the screen is. When you first arrive at the machine, you turn the main switch on the side, you have to then select your language, Spanish, Swedish, or English. Hit the start button. It brings you up to the welding screen, which is uh, the main screen that uh, the operator would use. And um, select your options that you want to run. When you start uh, welding, you want to select the options that you want to weld. And uh, we have a piece of vinyl laying out here that it's going to weld the pocket on, maybe. And uh, what we want to do is uh, use the total length program that has the, the size of the uh, material already put into it. The first one and we can do that. Pull the pocket in place, and then uh, we can move the machine into place. Okay, when the machine stops, it'll stop uh, if you have a program to the right edge of the material. In the total length program, we put in the length of the fabric, which the machine is then going to go the length of the fabric. So, if you want to just get the machine started, well, get in the pocket. And when the pocket is ready, you can then uh, select the button to go back to the beginning of the program. Should you desire to move the machine out of the way, you just simply select one cycle and move it out of the way. You can easily put a new pocket in, get it set up, lined up. Once again, hit it back. Okay, so uh, we have a graphics material that we want to seal, and um, I put in a couple settings here: one second, uh, one and a half second seal time, one eight second cool time, uh, four bars of pressure, and I use the auto tuning system to automatically control the weld for accurate and consistent welding. So make a little pocket, and um, we'll see how it works. Get this lined up, and we'll control the length of the program. Ready? Or you go uh, and work well. On the arc is on, it just flashes with a lightning bolt so that you can eat. It measures up the uh, length of the fabric, welds it. Die changing system. If you have another bar, maybe one without tape, you want to gloss the surface. If you have another one, you just hit the die button. Put the die out. Put the next one in. So, not only is the machine easy to use, it also has advanced features and very simple recipe savings uh, features. If, once you have set this program up, you want to save it, you go into settings recipes and uh, simply hit the upload button and it changes the values on your mesh program and it is now saved in there. Also should you want to have a longer name, proper name of your uh, mesh program for better explanation you can um, go in here and type in more information with for example, and um, that will give you more information so it's easier to use. Also you can uh, easily recall other programs by getting through the menu here. And uh, depending on the size of the memory card, your storage is virtually unlimited for programs. And. Um, if you wanted to save it, you could do it, or otherwise, you just 
go into the new program, large vinyl, and um, you can use that program and just simply return. Also, you can uh, do the advanced travel features from this screen, and uh, there's absolute positioning program, or you can set a uh, multitude of different uh, starting points if you want to weld several different uh, products on the same table and you uh, lay them out on prescribed distances, or you have a product that have welds that are not all in a row but on different places of your product, you simply put your uh, parameters in on the absolute value from the starting position how far you want the weld out to be, and it could be, for example, 9,000 millimeters out on the first one, then come back to 100 millimeters away on the second one, and uh, go back 5,125 millimeters maybe on the next one. It's a sequential program that will start the weld at these prescribed distances. It can be very useful for um, complicated products. Also, um, if you want to optimize your overlaps so that your weld strength becomes optimum, you take and insert your total length of your product in the first number and your tool length, and it automatically compensates for the overlap. And it'll also show you what the overlap is going to be, what the travel distance is going to be, how many sealings you need to do before it's going to be done. So it's a very useful feature. And uh, not only that, your alarm logs also come standard with the machine. And it shows you the last um, alarms for ease of troubleshooting. You can scroll down and see when you use different materials, different products, if they cause arcs. You can see what different operators are doing, if they are hitting the e-stop, if they are uh, going into overload. and. Uh, help to optimize the production. Also has you an hour meter, tells you how long the machine's been on in operation. And um, down here you have the buttons for different, uh, uh, if you have laser for ease of alignment. If you want to delay the press uh, after the one cycle is completed, it will delay the welding press if you have that button activated. And these parameters you can set up here in the limit values. You can optimize the machine for your specific product, for your specific material, with a multiple parameters that allows you to get optimum production and optimum quality in a very simple setup. All screen-based, Windows-like, familiar, operations that anybody can understand. And that's the gist of the Fiat machine. Hope you like it and uh, hope you buy one soon.